There's only one way we name stars, and that's by committee and by traditions and this sort of thing. Uh, it's, they're fascinating traditions. So planets are named after Roman gods, and pl planet moons uh, are named after Greek characters in the life of the Greek god who's the counterpart to that Roman god. Wow. So Jupiter, for example, one of its moons is Ganymede. Ganymede was the manservant of Zeus, and Zeus and Jupiter were corresponding uh, gods in mm -hmm. Greek and Roman. And not only that, about half, somewhere around there, of all the stars in the night sky that have names have Arabic names. So in my field, we have deep respect for people who made great inroads into understanding the natural universe. And the golden age of Islam from a thousand years ago made material contributions in this regard. And of course, Greek and Roman legends and this sort of thing. So there they are in its influence on Western culture.